2018 Gabor Spring Collection. This is the shortest little girl in her collection. Her name is called So Stylish and it truly is because it's uh, longer on top. It's like five here, four and a half, five and a half, and then down here it's in your fours and your threes. But the nape is only one and three fourths, so it's really short. And then the sides are like two, two and a fourth. I'm going to try it on for you, and you can see. What I love about the longer top, number one, it's right on trend, as we know. But number two, because it's longer, you can back comb it, you can crunch it with your spray gel, or uh, your cream for making it PC, or you can re leave it really smooth. I'm going to show it now. Let's see. So stylish, little mama. Let's take it off. Okay, this is a round neck in the back and an open cap. What I mean by a round neck is you don't see that throat that comes down. A lot of times you'll have the little throat in the wig because they want to throw the hair one way or another in a shag or, or whatever, or they're going to have longer hair there. But this one is so short and we want that look. So that's why you make it in just a circle without the throat. I don't know why I tell you all that stuff. You guys don't care. Okay, here we go. I'm going to make it a little tighter because you know I have no neck. I have a painted hand. But I'm alive! Yes! Okay, babies. Here we go. I'm going to put it on. Like that, I catch it on my forehead, pull it all the way back to that round base that's right there on my occipital bone, where that indentation is. Then I'm going to walk around, I'm going to find those little temple tabs, there's the stay. I grab the hair and I pull it so that it's even, like an arrow going right through my head. And then I grab the hair and I go, one, two, pulling forward, one, two, three, four. What does that do? It's just a little step that you throw in there. But what it does is it seats this into your nape where it throws it just right. And then you get your little poof. Now, the last thing we're going to do is take it up to my hairline. If you don't want your ears to show at all, could you cover your ears with this little two and a half Maybe, but I think probably not so much. A lot of you that wear hearing aids or you don't like the tops of your ears showing, you look for uh, wigs that are longer here. This is about two, two and a half as it goes around. So you can see most of my ear is showing love. So I would push it back all the way and then to keep it smooth, this is really a cute look. Hold from the side and just kind of lightly brush it into that little barrel cut. Isn't that cute? Or you can take your little brush or your little styling comb and just gump it up like that. See, there's no rhyme or reason. And just back comb it a little bit. Then you take your little spray gel doo -doo -doo -doo, and go like this. Tuzzle it. Isn't that cute? It's versatile. You can make it flat back all the way like a little boy cut. Make it like this, like you just dumped your head in the water bucket and it's PC. This is adorable. The color is called 1823 Toasted Pecan. A lot of you are um, familiar with 1822 and that's kind of a silvery, just maybe getting on the edge of turning a little gray, 1822. My mom used to wear 1822 all of the time. Anyway, the 1823 is a little more blonde. You don't get that ash in there at all. You see that lighter blonde. The 18 is the 
light, light, light brown. And then the 23 is that golden super streak that you see going through. Wouldn't this be cute on a boat with tennies, little crop pants? The wind blows. You don't have to worry about anything. You just go like this. So natural. That's what I love about it. So natural. See? I don't even have to look at it. Nobody will know, babe. Have a great summer. Have a great spring. Bye.